You can see all four of these great stars tonight at the Lebanon Airport Armory. Matter of fact, Style and Shane is going for the North American title of the Colorado tonight in Lebanon. What a match that's going to be. You're also going to see that maniac manager, Shorty Taylor. He'll be there at ringside for Brickhouse Brown tonight in Lebanon. Chris Michaels will be there. Handsome Andy Anderson, Deputy Dog, and of course the big one, Flanagan against Ringens. Absolutely no rules. Brickhouse Brown sends the knee to the midsection, and Chris Michaels down hard to the match with a punch to the side of the face. Also, I want to remind all the great folks in Gallatin this Friday night. Now, you can get advanced tickets from Jimmy Hale or any of the Dixie Baseball uh, kids up there. The Dixie Baseball League uh, advanced tickets, only 8 bucks. We're going to be at Thompson Park under the stars this Friday, June 19th. And that big Grand Slam match is going to be a box on all four bases. Two of the box are going to have some big old baseball bats. Whoever gets them can use them. And I tell you what, I hope Rex King and Flash Frannigan can get them bats and just beat the devil out of Stephen Dunn and Reno Riggins. Also, ladies and gentlemen, big action coming to Louisville Gardens this Tuesday night. We want to see you there every Tuesday at the world-famous Louisville Gardens. Now, Gallatin, if it's raining next Friday, don't worry about it because the show will be at the big Civic Center up there. Rain or shine, Gallatin has wrestling Friday night, and don't miss that Grand Slam match in Gallatin Friday night. But most importantly, of course, tonight we want to see you in Lebanon. Big, big show in Lebanon tonight and Friday night Gallatin. And in fact, you can get them tickets tonight in Lebanon for Gallatin this Friday night. In the ring, we got Michaels laying on the mat after Andy Anderson suplexed him with a double arm suplex. And here comes Anderson in trying to uh, fight off Style and Shane Eaton. Brickhouse Brown got the tag, drops the elbow on Michaels. And Michaels gonna have to get something going here for sure. Drops the elbow and Michaels rolls to the side. And here comes the referee asking, was there a tag? And I didn't see one and I don't think the fans did either. But Brickhouse Brown and Andy Anderson, they'll break the rules any way they can to score that pinfall here in Music City Wrestling. Here comes the tag in, the Style and Shane Eaton. Drops the elbow down on the arm, arm bar and twist. Got Brickhouse Brown tied up at this moment. Brickhouse Brown, definitely the veteran of this uh, tag team matchup here. Style and Shane Eaton, gonna be rookie of the year, no doubt. He was Rookie of the Year last year, 1997 Rookie of the Year, Style and Shane Eaton, and he's the, going for the title tonight in Lebanon against the Colorado Kid. That match will be worth the eight bucks to see it tonight. Style and Shane collide against the Colorado Kid for the belt tonight. Brickhouse underneath, up and over, nobody's home. Down hard to the match, Style and Shane with a nice arm drag on Brickhouse Brown. Everybody loves Style and Shane at MCW Wrestling. And if you have a chance to see him on a card near you, make sure you do that real soon. Also want to tell all the great folks in Springfield, we had a great time there last Sunday, and wrestling will return to the Springfield, the beautiful air-conditioned center, Sunday night, July 12th, with a big card, Sunday night, July 12th. And ladies and gentlemen, wrestling returns to Nashville, Saturday night, July 4th. We'll announce the card next week here. Wait till you see what's coming to Nashville. You talk about fireworks. You talk about an explosion. You might as well mark the calendar right now because there's only one place you're going to want to be July 4th, and that's the Nashville Fairgrounds Arena because we got an incredible match sign for Independence Day, Saturday night, July 4th. Woo! It's going to be intense. Saturday night, July 4th when wrestling returns to Nashville at the Nashville Fairgrounds Sports Arena. Style and Shane Eden laying on the mat here. Brickhouse Brown overlooking him. And I tell you, Bert, Style and Shane Eden's been teaching me some of them dance steps he does when he comes into the ring. And I tell you, he is uh, quite a dancer indeed. Not only that, a good wrestler. What an athlete. Brickhouse Brown with a suplex to take him over. Got him for the cover. Referee down for the count. We got two Close three there, Bert. Our producer, Brian Thompson, says we got to take a break. You won't miss any of the action, folks. We promise we'll, we'll get back to right where we left off when we return on MCW Wrestling. Don't forget Lebanon tonight. Back to action here on MCW Wrestling. Handsome Andy Anderson whips Style and Shane across. A big power slam down to the mat. Style and Shane. Andy goes for the cover. Chris Michaels in to break the count up. 
Andy Anderson definitely the power man in this situation. Styling Shane Eden, dropping about 50 pounds to the big Anderson and dropping the elbows down on Eden's head. Styling Shane in a world of trouble here, and here comes Anderson, backing him into the neutral turnbuckle here. Just throwing some fists into the midsection. Referee calling for the break. Irish whip across. Big reversal by Eden. Slide, baseball slide right out. Drops him down. Jerks him into that steel post. And I tell you, the fans are begging for this one. Give it to him, Shane. Oh, yes. Drops him right into that post. Andy Anderson in trouble here and just getting old fashioned spanking he sure by Style and Shane Eden. I'll tell you what, Andy's going to need to book himself a spot on that MCW cruise that's going out to sea on October 22nd through the 25th. Style and Shane will be on that cruise. Up and over, whoa, a flying drop kick and nobody is home. I tell you what, on that ship, ladies and gentlemen, call 1-800-CRUISE-2. 1-800-C-R-U-I-S-E-2. If you wanna go, call, ladies and gentlemen. Call let them know you're wanting to go on that cruise. MCW Cruise, we're gonna have a great time. I can't wait for that, Bird. I got my tanning lotion all, already out. Outer swoop across. Big forearm smash to the top of Style and Shane's head, and Shane Eden needs to make a tag, and that is for sure. Brickhouse Brown flaunting himself to the crowd, and I tell you, Brickhouse Brown, is he the most arrogant guy in MCW or what? Absolutely, and I tell you what, there's a lot better wrestlers here at MCW Wrestling, and they're, they're fixing to show Brickhouse Brown. And back tonight, in Lebanon, Deputy Dog is making the long trip tonight to, to Lebanon to take on Brickhouse Brown. What a match that's gonna be tonight in Lebanon. Style and Shane needs to make a tag, and that's for sure. I tell you, if he don't get something going here quick, this match is gonna be over. Dumps him to the outside, and Style and Shane holding his back. And here comes Andy Anderson down to the floor. Referee tied up at this moment, and Anderson taking his face right into the chair. Style and Shane sitting in the front row with the fans. Meanwhile, the referee tied up. Michaels needs to get back and let the referee do his job. Andy Anderson dragging him up by the hair of the head, picks him up. Don't slam him on the floor. Yes, sirree, right onto the floor. And notice no pretty blue pads here in the MCW. Handsome Andy Anderson picking Style and Shane up, throwing him back into the ring. Referee Eric Hicks is back. In the corner, my gosh, Brickhouse Brown now just choking with that size 13 boot on Style and Shane Eden, handsome Andy Anderson. Brings him up, picks him up for a body slam down hard to the mat. Handsome Andy Anderson out of Montreal, Quebec, Canada. It was great seeing the legends Harley racing early Anderson last Saturday at the National Fairground Sports Room. Folks, if you, did, if you missed that NWA 50th anniversary show, what a night we had. What a night we had. It was just unbelievable. Style and Shane Eden, they're grimacing from the pain from the headbutt to the ribs of handsome Andy Anderson. Bird, I got to tell you, it was a thrill of my life to meet the original four horsemen, Ole Anderson and Jackie Fargo and all the other guys that come in for that reunion show. And here's Anderson setting Style and Shane on that top rope. He says it's over, trying to make his way up to the top rope. Referee's trying to get him down. Style and Shane in a world of trouble here. And here comes Anderson off. Atomic knee drop right on Andy Anderson. And Anderson is, uh, well, let's say that was the most blow. That was the most strange maneuver I've ever seen in my entire life. In 40 years, I've never seen nothing like that. I've got to replay that when I get home. I've never seen anything like that before. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is turning into a long match. And Brian says it's time to take another break. And we'll take the chain flipped in, up and over. Is this the one, two, three? Go Get over the there. Count of two. Nope. We'll take a break. We promise you will not miss any of the action. And we'll be back with this match in just a few seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, don't go away. We've got lots more show left. And don't forget, Lebanon tonight. Back to ring action here. Tag team action going on. Style and Shane trying to make that tag as needed so bad. In comes Michaels, in comes Brickhouse Brown. Michaels throwing the haymakers here. Brickhouse Brown down to the mat. Anderson follows up with another one. Michaels on a world of fire here. Slams the two heads together, Anderson and Brickhouse Brown. Style and Shane over to uh, take on Brickhouse Brown and Style and Shane going to the outside. Meanwhile in the ring, we got Michaels and Anderson dumped to the outside. And look at Michaels going up top all the way up top. 
Off to the concrete floor with a double axe handle blow to Anderson. Anderson landed up in the front row here and the referee got his hands full. That's an understatement chance, I'll tell you what. Anderson with a handful of hair running Chris Michaels into that pole. Who knows where Brickhouse, Brown, and Style and Shane are. I hope we don't have the Orkin man hiding back there again. There's Brickhouse, Brown. Jimmy Smith trying to park the action there. Man, I'm going to try to get out of the way here. Uh-oh, they're going upstairs again. Handsome Andy Anderson, Chris Michaels. Oh, don't tell me someone's been thrown off the balcony again. Hard into the upstairs bleachers. Handsome Andy Anderson, Chris Michaels upstairs. Downstairs, you got Brickhouse Brown and Style and Shane Eden tearing my building apart. Well, these four simply hate each other. That's the understatement of the year, Bert. Anderson back. Big backdrop on the stage on the concrete floor. I tell you what, Anderson, you're talking about taking him out, Michaels. And Anderson, if they don't hate each other, I don't know who does. Michaels and Anderson just battling all over this building, up on the stage of all, on the balcony. And we're talking no pads here, battling back down the steps. Only in Music City Wrestling are you gonna see excitement like this, fans, I tell you. Well, it seems to be in the last few weeks, they, oh my gosh, down the steps! He went down the whole flight of steps! My God. Oh my right. gosh, he's gotta be hurt. I mean, right into the crowd. The crowd gathering around. Oh, right my head. God, Shane Aiden takes that barrier right into the whole face of Brickhouse Brown. This has turned into a false count anywhere in the building. I tell you, the referee trying to get order restored. Is there even a referee left in this match? If there's a referee, I don't see him. All I can tell you is Anderson's laid out. Big elbow drop off the top rope, and Michaels has got him beat right here in the middle of the ring. We got a five count, Bert, and no referee to call it. Might there be a referee anywhere in the building? Into the steel goes Brickhouse Brown and Michaels dragging him in by the hair of the head. The people all trying to get back to their seats. They're excited and they're on their feet at MCW and that's the way we like it. Uh, and you'll be excited and on your feet tonight in Lebanon at the airport armory in Lebanon tonight, folks. Don't miss that, fans. I tell you, Music City Wrestling coming to a town near you. You better buy a ticket because it's the best thing going today. I will guarantee you that. Anderson and Style and Shane Eden battling it out here in the center of the squared circle. And Anderson, just haymaker after haymaker. And Style and Shane scooped up with a big body slam. And into the steel goes Brickhouse Brown. This is too much to call, Bert. I tell you, action all over the floor here. Action is all over, and you got to be worried because that maniac shorty taylor could be hiding in one corner the atomic dog could be hiding in another corner that goof gordon dunaway could be hiring in another corner brickhouse has his whole entourage and you never know who's around the corner and whoa is it a count of three it we is a count of count. three and style and shane and chris michaels have just won this match style and shane and chris michaels andy anderson is furious because he promised brick Brickhouse that they absolutely would win this. Anderson got pissed at Brickhouse. He's furious. That was one of the deadliest pile drivers I've ever seen. Whoop, we're going to lose a the referee there. That's going to cost you 500 bucks, Mr. Brown. Referee's been outside the whole time, and Brickhouse just put him right back out there again. See, Kyle and Shaney, Chris this, Mike. Is the, this is the epitome of sore losers right here. Handsome Andy Anderson, Brickhouse Brown, now Brown. Stuff pile driver. Nobody does a deadlier pile driver than Brickhouse Brown, and I'm comparing this to any of the legendary folks. Brickhouse Brown can, I tell you what. Yeah. There's the deputy dog finally coming to clean house. The deputy dog. And we needed some help here. Brickhouse Brown and Andy Anderson finally Direct getting from, stopped. Absolutely. There's the atomic dog. I told you that entourage is around, and I'll guarantee you Shorty Taylor and Gordon Dunaway's around too. They're a headbutt down. The deputy dog from Louisville, Kentucky is cleaning.